Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me. My name is Carl. Today's video, I'm going to be calling this an Independence Day adventure because I don't know how it's going to plan out just yet. Last Thursday, I visited my local CEX in Staines and to be fair, they didn't have much in. Just as I was walking out, something caught my eye way up high on the shelf behind the counter. Now, it's one of my favourite films. I saw this movie at the cinema and there was this box and it was called Independence Day. We, we all know Independence Day, the movie. And I was thinking, what on earth is that? And I walked out and it left me thinking for a few days. What is that? Independence Day. Independence Day. I'm just seeing how many times I can fit the title Independence Day into this video. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'll get on your nerves in a minute and you'll just press stop. <laughs> really, really sorry. No, seriously. I did a little bit of research online because this was really bugging me. It is one of my favourite movies. And I went on Amazon and it is in fact Independence Day, the Attack Edition. I thought, I've never ever seen that before. Now, Amazon had one left in stock at £139.99p. So I decided to go on eBay. So I typed it in on eBay. Only four came up. And they were averaging just over £100. And the dearest one was £300. But it was only four. And I thought, well, this must be quite rare. So I decided to contact my good friend, Big Paulie. And he has got back to me and said, I do remember this edition coming out at the time he's never seen one for sale in a shop before and they are quite rare so i messaged him back and said they had one in cex at 45 pounds do you think it's actually worth it or not do i really want to buy this he messaged me back and said definitely worth 45 pounds so i decided why not go to Staines, see if I can pick this up, because I do like the movie back in 1996. I'm not actually sure what the condition was like, and I don't even know if they have it in stock anymore. This was last Thursday, and today is Monday, so that's four days. It could quite easily have sold in four days, but we're going to head to Staines, see if we can pick it up, being a Monday as well, I'm going to pop into my local HMV and there's a couple of titles that I might want to get as well. Strays, possibly the Nun 2. Not too sure on the Nun 2 yet, but we'll see when we get there. So let's jump into our FA-18 fighter jet and head to Staines. Not really, just Bluey the car. Squad on leaders, take point. So I finally arrived here in Staines. I say finally arrived, I'm telling you, I really do wish I had that FA-18 Hornet to get here because I'd have been here in seconds. It's taken a while to get here because they've got a new road layout where they're building the new Shepparton Studios and they've got lights up there. I've just passed lights coming into Staines as well because they're just starting to put the Christmas decorations up. I'm looking at the decorations. You've got some red ball balls with some white lights going down the side. I'll show you guys in a moment. So I've arrived here. We're going to grab a coffee. I think we'll do that first. I have no idea whether CEX still has the Independence Day Attack Edition in stock because I haven't checked. I thought it'd be a total surprise. <laughs> If they haven't got it, then this video is a complete waste of time. But I will do some other stuff to make up for it. But yeah, I, I like to leave it a surprise. They might have it in stock, they might not. We've had Saturday and Sunday for them to sell it. Please do get involved in the comments down below. I'd love to know for this video. Have you ever seen Independence Day Attack Edition 
Blu-ray? If you have, please do let me know in those comments because I know Keith from Euphoria Pictures, he definitely would have, but I wanna know if anyone else has as well. Keith, if you're watching, put in those comments because I'm sure you probably got this one as well. It's quite rare. It is really rare to get. So I'm really hoping they've got it in stock. I do feel that Independence Day had one of the best president speeches ever in a movie. Should we win the day, the 4th of July will no longer be known as an American holiday, but as the day when the world declared in one voice, we will not go quietly into the night. We will not vanish without a fight. We're going to live on. We're going to survive. Today, we celebrate our Independence Day. <laughs> Seems to be the way of life now. Go shopping, have a coffee in between, which is pretty good idea. I remember back in the day when you were shopping, you just do your shopping and go home, but now stop for coffee and watch the rest of the world go by. Remember that Frozen song? Let it go, let it go. I really should let it go. That was just because they never let me film inside there. As you can see, CEX is behind me. I've got my famous Christmas Jamie Powell bag to put Independence Day Attack Edition, if they still have it, in that bag so no one else can see. Let's pop inside, see if they have it. That's what I call a close encounter. Well, just come out of CEX, and as you saw, they did have it in stock. I did check the condition before I actually bought it. It's in pretty good condition. I used a CEX voucher, and so really pleased. And we're back in the car where it all started. A very successful shopping trip to Staines. Let's bring in the Jamie Powell Coca-Cola Christmas bag. It is in here. So let's see what I actually picked up. I did go into HMV and I did pick up a couple of titles in HMV. Now you all know I can't film inside my local Staines HMV without permission from head office. So they tell me. So the first movie I picked up is a movie I wanted to see at the cinema but never got round to seeing it. And it is strays this did not have a 4k release it did have a blu-ray and a dvd release so i picked up strays now this is an independence day video so i'm not going to go too much into what i actually picked up the next movie i picked up i've heard mixed reviews but it's good to have it in the collection the nun 2 it's got a lovely slip cover and then spinning it around to the back and that was the nun too those are what i picked up but i did pick up the main thing i wanted to get in stains if i can get it out of the bag quite easy there you go it's the independence day attack edition it comes with an alien spacecraft which i will show you when i get it out of the box 45 pounds with my voucher took it down in price round to the side of the box it's labeled id4 independence day round to the back of the box that's what you get inside this edition as you can see there are a couple of marks on the box but for second hand it is in quite good condition round to the other side of the box it's labeled again ID for it's a massive box. Underneath, there isn't 
much underneath, just stars with some lighting. And then if I spin it round to the top, there you go, you've got a better look at that spacecraft. I will get this out to show you what's included. ID4 Independence Day. You can see how I'm struggling. It is quite a big box. Really pleased to pick this up. So let's take a look inside. So I've opened one side of the box. I've taken the flap down so we can see this stars and galaxy on the bottom there. If I lift the lid up on the side, there we can see the alien spacecraft and a copy of Independence Day to the side of the box. With the alien spacecraft removed from the box, it's protected in this plastic. With the contents removed, the box itself does have some artwork of the motherships in space there. We do get a copy of the Blu-ray movie Independence Day. I do own this in 4K. Inside looks like this. We are getting two discs. We have the bonus disc with an image on and we also have the movie on Blu-ray with an image on the disc. This is the stand first where the alien ship is going to sit on top. We've got this nice title here, Independence Day. It's like an Estony effect which I like almost like the mother ships. One thing I have noticed about this is the material. It's just plastic. I do have the Lord of the Rings. I've got a, a Gollum statue. I've got the, the King's bookends where they're going like this. And they are made of, well, it's like an ornament, like a clay material, very solid, very heavy, where this one is just plastic. But I'm still happy to have it in the collection because it is rare. If I take it round to the back. Nothing round the back really. Back to the front. If we tip it. There you can see that nice pattern there. That's quite a nice pattern. And then the other way underneath. Onto the main piece. Again, it's plastic. It might be plastic, but there's so much detail on this alien craft. Take it round to the back. I will show you what it looks like on the stand in a moment. Look at the detail. And then taking it round to the other side, underneath the ship. I don't know if you can see the sides. Even these are so well detailed. It's well worth the money I paid in CX with that voucher to take it down in price. I know it's just a standard Blu-ray, but it is also quite rare. So let's take a look what it looks like on the stand. <laughs> And that's the Independence Day Attack Edition for the 1996 movie, Independence Day. I'm so pleased I never kept this camera rolling. Over 10 minutes to put this back in the box. I still don't know if I've actually put it back right. I'll have to double check once I've stopped filming. Let's just go around this box again. ID4 Independence Day. We've got that alien spacecraft in there. It is in a little bit of a disappointing plastic but it doesn't matter because I know how rare this is and it's one of my favorite movies it's probably the best up-to-date alien movie out there I just really hope they, God, I hope they bring, back Elvis. bring out a film vault edition of this movie because that would be pretty good and there we have it. That's the Independence Day Attack Edition for the movie Independence Day. 
If you like this video, please do give it a like. Also, don't forget to share and subscribe if you can. Thanks so much, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye. Time's up.